So here's the plot of my movie. Tell me what you think. So this is as far as I've gotten. Tell me if you think this is his potential. So you've got these two saturation drivers, d divers. One of them's experienced. One of them's a rookie. Two of them. They go down in twos, sometimes threes. I'm, I'm, I'm tearing this down to the bare minimum here just for you guys, taking all the background stuff out. They go down. They're down at the bottom. They're taking their time. They're doing the saturation, equalizing their body pressure. And so the rookie guy goes out the first night or the third night or whatever, does his shift. And I, I got to tell you, they're out in the middle of the ocean with like a little blow tour or like a welder, an underwater welding tool. So you can see flashes of like uh, sparks of light and electricity in an otherwise completely dead dark zone. So he does a shift. The experienced guy hears something clank, something went wrong. He hears yelling on the radio. So he goes down there. He saves. <gasps> because of inexperience, this guy got into some trouble. Either the welder messed up or he, he got a leak on his oxygen or something. But he brings him back and everything's fine. <clears throat> then he does his shift. Everything goes good. He's, a, he's the veteran. But then the next day, the rookie goes out again to do a shift. But this time, each shift is two hours. He doesn't come back from his shift. The veteran goes out there to look for him. He's not. He's gone. He's just gone. Bottom of the ocean, darkness. There's no trace of him. He's gone. Boys, did I miss the send? Everyone's gone now? That's all I have. Wow. I have a few other ideas. I'm just not sure. You know, it could be like an underwater uh, alien civilization. That's just the abyss. Right, okay, so we're not gonna go that route. But I was really, I was thinking more like Blair Witch Project type of just like, uh, just like the visuals and the horror of just not seeing stuff, you know, that kind of angle. Mm -hmm. Just the unknown. That's a good, that's a scary premise though, right? Yeah. I mean, it's scary underwater. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm not totally sold yet. Okay. I'm going to be honest. Right. I, I see, I see it in my head. A little bit. It needs work. It needs work. Yeah. I hate going in the ocean. The characters feel a little flat to me. I mean, well, veteran and rookie. I mean, what are their names? Who are they about? Do I they know. Have any I did. I'm not. The I, surface? Do they have a wife, a girlfriend? Yes. Yes. But that, I did not. I'm just trying to tell you the premise. Hmm. Do they find the Titanic? No. Oh. I'm out. You need some Tulkun in there. There's some, yeah, there's there some were Avatar lore distinct in there. lack of toon coons in okay, this Okay, so then there's blue uh, creatures. I disagree with that. Yeah. I think that there's a, a good amount of toon coon happening, and there's that is zero. There's too much toon coon already? That what is the, zero. What is toon coon? That's the talking whale. That's the big whales. Well, I haven't I mean, seen Avatar 2 yet? No. The Eat it! Water. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Come so th on. then at the bottom, there's like these blue creatures that want, they just want to wrap their little tendrils around them, and that's their way of having sex. Is there a sex scene in this movie? You there would be, yes. Of they course. find love. There'll just be a jerk off. There would be There'll be a jerk off scene. He's alone <laughs> and he just jerks off. He jerks off <laughs> underwater. He's just sad and he's stressed out. No, uh, in his little, in his uh, habitat. Ah, uh, it's like, a, it's a flashback moment. He remembers right. his life on land. He's like, I miss my friend. I'm gonna go beat off. Like, yep. You know? What if the divers fell in love with each other? A little broke back uh, mountain type of thing, mm -hmm. where they or only be them true selves in the pod. That's kind of a fire angle. Broke, They're broke lovers. back trench. The ocean. Broke back trench. <laughs> <laughs> so they're only lovers, but then maybe something goes wrong. Maybe he cheats. With, he fucks one of the blue aliens. One of the fish. Infidelity. He fucks a fish. Doom this doom. is where they live. This is where they live. Damn. And then is... on this side, there's just a hole that goes into the ocean. It this is a good is... setting. Unironically, that is a good setting for a horror movie, though. Thank right. you. It's That's a, all I'm thought. saying. Yeah. Now I now you do the hard part. Now I'm gonna hire a writer. So <laughs> now you do the rest. Flesh it out. Create and put my name Characters. On it. Good dialogue. Exactly. Here's a little preview of what your deep sea creature could look like. I come out of the pool. With one what do eyeball. I see? A, the eye of a man who's on DMT, who's just come out of a 
deprivation tank for five days. 